We enter 2024 at the Giant Axe in the pitching in Northern Premier League Premier Division as a Lancaster City host Atherton Collieries here on New Year's Day. Norris is playing in an advanced position as Dom Lawson with some superb work to close down. Central defender for Atherton Collieries, Jordan Boone. Uh, so we are on the way as Charlie Bailey plays the ball back to the edge of the area. Jake Connolly just leaves it for his teammate. Uh, Brad Carroll to have a strike and that one is well over the goal for Atherton Collieries just in front of Dolly's Diner corner of the penalty area uh, foul given up by Sam Bailey just waiting for this to be delivered whistle goes it's played in right in front of Andre Mendes and he makes a good save low down now Kyle Brownhill attempts to make the clearance Charlie Bailey just wins it back, then gets clattered, and there is a free kick. Goes back to Christian Sloan, who's got Carl Brownhill to the left of him. Uh, Carl Brownhill once again nominated for Player of the Month. As Sloan finds Charlie Barnes. Barnes edge of the box, strike on goal, it takes a deflection, and that is into the midriff of goalkeeper Joe O'Shaughnessy. True story. As the ball is over the top for Jake Connolly. Connolly on to the end of it. Strike on goal by Connolly and it's just wide he went with the right foot and it just goes past the post midfield not going to get past Christian Sloan who has Carl Brownhill to his left ball high in the air Carroll wins the header now edge of the box with David Norris strike on goal and it's rebounded off Boone for a corner kick movement by Simon Grand back stick that's where it's going Header up in the air by Grand, kept in play by Barnes, and Atherton clear on the line. There by the Atherton number 10. Sam Bailey takes over, forward it goes. Into the feet of Brad Carroll, Carroll edge of the box, looking for runners. Has Charlie Bailey out to his right. Charlie Bailey into the edge of the area, strike on goal, and it's a good save by Joe O'Shaughnessy. Now Cal Brownhill. Brownhill up against City Foe Farm on that far side just gets the better of his man now into the feet of David Norris Norris edge of the area low ball comes into Dom Lawson and it's a goal for Lancaster but the offside flag has gone up on the far on the near side uh, as the ball is cleared by Lancaster tackle on Lewis Mansell still Atherton have it edge of the area it's there's a strike on goal and it's just wide of Andre Mendes it's Oliver post. Putnam edge of the box that's collected by Charlie Barnes though now he slips over the ball ball through to Lewis Mansell there's an offside flag against the Atherton forward and he has it in the back of the net similar to Dom Lawson in the first half by the number four for Atherton Dylan Moonen quick free kick taken to the feet of Sam Bailey now wide is Jake Connolly up next to the Access Planet sign goes past the Chip Tech one now the Meta Mark sign and the cross comes into the back post. Header on goal. And it's into the back of the net. It's Brad Carroll with his fourth goal of the season. Great cross from Jake Connolly. 1-0 to Lancaster as the ball is taken down by Lewis Mansell. Now Rydell takes over. Bearing down on the penalty area for Atherton Collieries. Luciama lines up the strike and drags it wide. But there is a deflection off a Lancaster player. Now taken down by Charlie Bailey. There's Cal Brownhill. He's got Sam Bailey out wide. This time on the left-hand side. Sam Bailey with the delivery. It goes across the goalkeeper who spills it but now manages to take a second bite of the cherry. <laughs> Forward comes Lewis Mansell. Mansell one-on-one. -on -one. It! Uh, it's an equaliser for Atherton Collieries. Lancaster just failed to clear their lines edge of the box Distribution is to be made for Lancaster David Norris coming off for Jacob Holland Wilkinson and Charlie Bailey is coming off for Nick Angelino lead 2-0 against Ilkeston as the ball is fired up and over by Sidi Fofana from the free kick a superb delivery all it needed was poking in at the back stick strong Chester from Nick Evangelinos 
but Atherton re regained position. Now it's uh, Lewis Mansell, edge of the box, looking for teammates. He's got Adam Dawson. Cross comes in, back post again. Lewis Luciana and that, sorry, Enoch Luciana, and that one is into the back of the net for Atherton Collieries. Uh, offside flag has been raised against Atherton Collieries as there is six minutes of added time. Six minutes here for Lancaster to get something from this game as the corner is delivered onto the hop top of Joe Shaughnessy. It rebounds and into the back of the net as Lancaster have a late equaliser. I'd love to tell you who scored, I have no idea. As it bobbled up and over Joe Shaughnessy, took a deflection and Lancaster have a goal. As Joe O'Shaughnessy is being protected by two defenders. Sam Bailey with the long throw. It's into the box. It's flicked on. And it's into the net. It's not. In fact, it is into the net. It's a goal scored for Lancaster City. Lancaster have won it in the final couple of minutes. It was a header on goal taken with two players for Atherton in the final third. Uh, as the ball goes out <laughs> and all of a sudden <laughs> uh, the final whistle goes and Brad Carroll celebrates Brad Carroll gives us a fist shake high in the air it is the final whistle here on Dolly Blue Sound it is 3-2